everyone, today we are going to make a DC motor. What is a DC motor? A DC motor takes in electrical energy and converts that into mechanical energy. Now we know what a DC motor is. Now we're going to make a DC motor. To make a DC motor, we are using duct tape, a cylindrical object, two safety pins, a battery, a permanent magnet, and a copper wire. First, we're gonna get our copper wire and our cylindrical object and wrap the copper wire around the cylindrical object to make a coil. Our parents made the coil out of the copper wire and they got and they removed the enamel from the ends of the coil to make the electricity flow through. Now I'm going to take the battery and the safety pins and I'm going to attach it like this upside down not this way. Both of the safety pins have to be upside down and then I'm going to attach those safety pins with duct tape. Now we attach the two safety pins to the battery. Now I'm going to take the copper coil and put it through the holes of the pin. And then I'm going to take the permanent magnet and then spin it. Whoa! Keep on spinning fast, fast, yeah, fast, 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 fast. When it spins mostly fast, it looks like a ball. Yeah, ball spinning fast. Wow. wow! It's spinning faster and faster. Yeah, it's like a core. So what's happening is this permanent magnet has its own magnetic field and when the current passes through the coil, it creates a second magnetic field and opposite poles attract and same poles repel and that repelling force makes the copper coil spin. Wow, it's spinning. Yeah, it's so amazing and cool. Yeah, it's spinning continuously. It's never gonna stop, I think. Yeah, it's so amazing. Yeah. Now, we made a DC motor and learned what a DC motor is and learned what's happening and why this copper coil is spinning. Thanks, Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to our channel, Kids Girl, for more fun science experiments. See you next time. Bye!